Hi guys, welcome to the channel. So in today's video, we'll see how to bootload an Atmega 328P with the help of Arduino Uno. First, connect the Arduino Uno to a laptop or a desktop. Now, open your Arduino IDE and go to Tools and then select your board. Next, select your port. Next, select your programmer as Arduino as ISP. Now, go to File and select the sketch Arduino ISP under Examples. Next, upload the sketch to your Arduino Uno to make it an ISP. Now to verify if the upload was successful, connect an LED with the 220 ohm resistor to the pin 9. Now if you get the fade effect or the heartbeat effect, then your upload is successful. Mount the Atmega 328P on a breadboard. Next, connect a 10K ohm resistor to pin 1. Next, connect the free end of the 10K resistor to VCC or 5V. Next, connect pin 1 of the Atmega 328P to pin 10 of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect pin 7 to VCC or 5V. Next, connect pin 8 to ground. Next, connect the 16 MHz crystal to pin 9 and 10. Next, connect one end of the 22 picofarad to pin 9 and the other end to the ground. Next, connect one end of the second 22 picofarad to pin 10 and the other end to ground. Next, connect pin 17 of Atmega 328P to pin 11 of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect pin 18 of the Atmega 328P to pin 12 of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect pin 19 of the Atmega 328P to pin 13 of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect pin 20 to VCC or 5V. Next, connect pin 21 to ground. Next, connect the ground of the breadboard to the ground of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect the VCC of the breadboard to the plus 5V of the Arduino Uno. Next, connect the Arduino Uno to a laptop or a desktop. After connecting the Arduino Uno to laptop, open the Arduino IDE and then go to Tools and select the board. Next, select the port and then select the programmer and then click on burn bootloader which will bootload your Atmega 328P. Thank you for watching guys. Please stay safe and stay healthy. See you in the next video.